XL Energy will be under scrutiny tomorrow as state regulators gather feedback from the public about how XL preemptively shut off power to some people 10 days ago. Thousands of people were impacted. Nine News reporter Janelle Finch is in Littleton tonight. And Janelle, you spoke with a business owner who's planning to speak his mind. Kim and Kyle, that's right. Business here at the Columbine Bar and Restaurant in Littleton is back to normal, but frustrations are still fresh even 10 days after those outages. The state says that 55,000 Excel Energy customers had their power turned off during that windstorm earlier this month. The owner here at the Columbine Bar and Restaurant says he was without electricity for several days. Ken Katzenmeyer says he missed out on business and lost at least $1,000 worth of food. He knows the shutoff was for safety reasons, but he wishes Excel's communication could have been better. More frustrating than anything. It'd be great if they could sit there and tell you, hey, going off here, coming back on then. But I understand that they can't always do that. They don't know what kind of damage they've got out there, what's got to get fixed, but they could relay it. Now, this is the first time that Excel cut off electricity ahead of extreme weather as opposed to in response to it. Tomorrow, the commission is set to hear from business owners like Ken and other people affected by those outages. That meeting is set to begin tomorrow at 4 p.m. Live in Littleton, Janelle Finch, 9 News.